The oxygen suddenly vanished, and everyone in the world died one after another. A diver surfaced and, as soon as he took off his oxygen mask, felt a suffocating sensation in his throat, he quickly put his mask back on. At first, he thought something was wrong with him, but then he saw dead animals everywhere. When he returned to his car, his girlfriend was gone. It was then that he realized the world's oxygen had disappeared. After a simple farewell to his girlfriend, he began searching for survivors. He first found a house, where dripping clothes proved someone was inside. After pushing the door open, he met a woman who had also survived. He showed her that he meant no harm, and they communicated using sign language. The woman decided to leave with him. They collected the remaining oxygen tanks. The man looked at the woman's oxygen tank, then his own, silently praying that the worst would not happen. So they rode an electric scooter, continuing their search for other survivors. The road was littered with bodies, and their hearts were filled with grief. They climbed a mountain and set off a smoke bomb but received no response. Just then, fireworks suddenly burst in the sky. They followed the direction of the fireworks and eventually arrived at a house. But the people inside were already dead. The fireworks had been set up beforehand. Seeing this, they fell into despair. The woman took off her clothes, intending to have one last dance with the man to bid farewell to the world. The man's oxygen was running out. He prepared to put on his last tank. The woman saw her oxygen tank was also almost empty. She questioned the man, who replied he was powerless to help. The instinct to survive led her to fight with the man. A deer head decoration fell from the wall, and the man fell to the floor. Ultimately, he was stabbed in the heart and lost his life. The woman, in the end, couldn't escape the same fate of losing oxygen.